And we're back for another episode, a fantastic episode of the Taste Buds. CJ, how are you today, Buddy Rowe? I'm cold. Are you okay? It has been cold for a few days, but at least we're not in Texas cold. No, you, no. Your cows aren't freezing in the field. No, no, no. Your beef's not cold. Nope. Now, if y'all hear a cow, you could potentially hear a cow. There are some cows not far from our camera right now, and you might hear them on the uh, on the old microphones. But today, we're not talking about cows. We're talking about chicken. Chicken pot pies, to be exact. And do you know why we're doing chicken pot pies? Because it's cold. Because it's cold, and there's no better heartwarming, good old home-cooked food, even though these are from the freezer section at our home local grocery store. food. Than these. And this came to us courtesy of T. Brown, who is one of our faithful faithful subscribers she's been with us a long time she success suggested a lot of stuff and she suggested pot pies and so today we're going to sample four of the top brands of pot pies and that's hard to say pot pie. top brands of pot, pot pies we're going to sample them they're warm they're fresh out of the oven and we're going to sample them when right after this d was <laughs> Get a reveal going. We're gonna find out. We we really matched you don't up like together. Those people, those are oh, both the Kins Ranch. Bar you S. don't want that. I'm not surprised. Yeah. There, there's like no way. Bar S. Classic Franks. All everything that's rad and tubular and extreme. And we're back with the first of the pot pies, and this is a very sad looking pot pie. Is it, you're not, you're not very fond of no, the no, way no, it just, looks like it's look, gooey ooey'd over? Look, look at the, like, there's more air in this than there is pot pie. You like my word gooey ooey? Gooey ooey'd over? And these are hot too. Yeah, we might not actually get a bit of a, like a taste on these things. Yes. You reckon this is real chicken? As opposed to the fake chicken? Oh my word. We might need more water. You know, my granny Juju, that was what I called my grandma. My granny on my, my daddy's side, granny Juju. She used to fix us these as a kid. This is what it reminds me of. But man, it's hot. Um, we might should have waited a minute before we, but I'm gonna move this to number four. Um, just as a starting point for it. Maybe I'll move it up, some others are worse. But. It's a pot pie. It's a frozen pot pie. Yeah. Yeah, I'll put it down there. I'm I'm not tasting much. It just it's kind of bland. Okay. Got another one coming up here in just a second. And we are back with uh, Umaro Duso of the Papayo. <laughs> Wasn't ready for that. This yeah. one this one is obvious a little better grade of pot pie. It's still a little gooey in that section right there, but we're gonna see exactly. How this crust talks to you? The crust. What did what did what did your crust say to you? It said subscribe to the channel. Subscribe. Oh, by the way, thank you, our hundred subscribers. You guys rock on YouTube. We we are forever indebted. And if you're watching on one of the other platforms, you know who you are: Rumble, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, all the other platforms. You people rock too. That one tastes a little better. Producers, y'all couldn't have blown on this a little bit before you brought it out here. That does have a little more um, homemade taste to it than the other one. Yeah. But you know what? You're not going to agree with me, but I think I like the other one a little better. Uh, maybe it's because I was so used to that one growing up, eating so many of those. None of these are the KFC pot pie, which is my personal favorite. Are you burning your mouth or like <laughs> bad about the KFC pot it's pie? It's hot. I'm moving that one up, and this one's going number four for me. I'll put it at number three, and we'll see how things keep shaking out with the pot pie. Another one on the way. And we're back with the pot pie con pollo. Okay. Yeah. You know what con pollo means? <clears throat> Wasn't he? Didn't he star in several uh, independent films back in the early '80s? Yes, he did. Yeah, they were spaghetti westerns. Mm -hmm. um, I like the way this looks. A it's bit. a little fancy. 
I mean, it's a little fancy. We're not used to eating this well around here. Well, yes, frozen <laughs> chicken pot pies is, is, is just a absolute treat. I'm just thankful we're not eating anything that's keto this week. <laughs> After, after what I put well, you through with those keto just, episodes. We just kept going through health food after health food, and it's nice to finally get to some comfort food because you know what? That's what we all want, a little comfort. This has been my TED Talk. You would think that enough time would pass between our taste test segments that these would cool off a little bit, but they're not. All right, so you've got to, you've got to give it a second to cool off because you cannot judge these fair when it's burning. I know the that's of what I'm mouth. trying to say. All right, all right. First off, one thing I've noticed in this one, whichever this one is, obviously it's a little better grade. The carrots, these are bigger chunks of carrots. Yes, I'm not a big carrot fan. Obviously, I know looking at me, you would say <laughs> the epitome of health that I am, that I, I would eat lots of vegetables, but just not a big carrot fan. The crust is good. It's creamier. This is much better. This is, this is this is the best by far. This is pretty good. I could eat For this. my highfalutin taste, I'm still going with the cheapo that cheapo. Is a, that is a stinking banquet pot pie that you keep pushing up. <laughs> and I like it. That's a, that's it's, it's the pot pie of my peeps. It's my peeps pot pie. This is going number one. This is a great pot pie. I don't know. Where you're at on that? That's delicious. All right, so we got one more. Can it top the other three? We'll see. We'll be right back. All right, we're back with the last pot pie, and this thing is ginormous. Look at that. Look, look, so look at where we started and where we're at. But the question is, do we save? Look, look at this. The best for last. Here we go. It's right off the bat. Breaking into it, it's creamier looking. It um, looks like a good pot pie. It does. So let's open it up, let it breathe a little bit. Let it breathe. Oh, it needs to breathe. It needs to breathe because these things are scalding hot. They came fresh out of the oven. By the way, while we're eating these, don't forget to go join our Thy Tasting Buds Facebook group, whereas our Facebook groupies Ooh. are watching us live right now, film this episode. Yeah, you could is, be one of them. That is good. Both of you that are out in Facebook land, we appreciate you. Oh my gosh, that's really good. Is it? The crust is buttery. The chicken is seasoned, which is a welcome surprise. This has almost got like a chicken okay. and dumplings. Yep. Kind of. This that, is great. That is good. That yeah. is that. That's good. <laughs> that's, that is good. That's pretty sticky, tasty. You got big, meaty chunks of chicken. You can look and see that. We might agree on this. In fact, look at this. This episode may go thirty minutes because we might have to finish I'm gonna, this. I'm one gonna eat this pot pie. Well, Y'all can just hang out right there. It's fine. Wow, that is good. That is. I don't need to take a whole lot more. That's delicious. Yep. That's about as good as as pot pie is going to get when you get yep. a frozen one. So, no doubt, we found a wiener. That's number one. That is number one. Okay. So, we're going to come back here in a second, and we're going to tell you how each of us felt about these pot pot. I can't even talk. These pot pies, how they lined up for each of us, and um, argue a little bit reveal about. Reveal which ones they are. Mm -hmm. Here we go. We'll be back right after this. We're back to reveal. The pot pies. Why don't you go first? Tell okay, me. I will go. I will go first. Uh, this little shorty right here, I'm guessing, is probably the banquet pot pie. That, that's that's the last one for me. Which that's like a dollar and like nine cent. So I mean, I don't still know. a good dollar for me. I mean, I oh yeah, it. it's, it's totally worth it. And then I got this one. I'm guessing maybe it's Marie Callender's. No, it's not. It is Stouffer's pot pie. Yeah. I'm. A little bit shocked on that, are you? Yeah, I thought for sure that was going to be Marie Callender's. This one is Marie Callender's. And the last one, the big boy, that's that's Boston Market. That's that's a fine pot pie. You this can't one, go wrong with that. This one right here has got all the things. Look, at they got corn, we've got peas, we've got chicken, and it's actually seasoned, which is shocking for frozen food. So, yeah, that's number one. That is a tasty tasty pot pie i would 10 out of 10 two thumbs up would recommend would try again so that's your your one two three four mm -hmm. my one two three four was uh, i had the banquet number two and i had the no oh, banquet don't fall over oh we had banquet upside down we had that's banquet right. number two i had the marie calendars was actually 
number four, and I had the Stouffer's number three, and then of course the walking dog of the the Boston Market. But here's here's the thing. Let's 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 clear this up for you guys. These two, let's put it here because here's all you need to know. If you're really really on a budget, get you the dollar one. Okay, that's it. If you need a pot pie on a budget, get this. Believe me, I'm not a budget eating anything. If you're going to go to the grocery store and budget's not an option for a pot pie, stock your freezer with the old Boston Market Let pot pies. Let me tell pies. you right now, once that crust soaks into this stuff, it's pretty daggum tasty. That is good. So T. Brown, thank you for suggesting this. Uh, we appreciate it. Y'all keep the suggestions coming in the comment section. We appreciate y'all watching the Taste Buds because we wouldn't be here if y'all don't watch. Hey, uh, this has been another episode. Don't forget to join our Facebook group. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the uh, notification button so you're notified whenever we uh, upload new content. And uh, hey, we're having a blast. This is season two. This is CJ. I'm Greg, and I can't. He's just eating and eating and eating, and he's probably going to eat mine. You act like you're not going to eat this from this camera. <laughs> he's right. Hey, we'll see you on the next episode of the Taste Buds, guys.